Bearcats in their annual Invitational. We're back to the action now, and there's Miha Breshjan and his young star athlete, Petra Mathis, who is in first place overall and here on her last event. These bars so wide for these young athletes. She actually has to jump from bar to bar. Line change, Jaeger, and another miss. Uh, and she had such a great competition going. Now, what's Coach saying now? Compose yourself. Compose yourself, it. yeah. Where to start back on your routine. Swing down for that overshoot. Very nice. Front giant swing, double front. Uh, and it was a fantastic bar routine, other than that big miss. Right here, beautiful straddled Jaeger just can't hold on. It's that slippery high bar that has given so many so much trouble. And young Picha, a little bit exasperated with an 8.7. She was in first place beginning that event. Here's Kareem Kava, who's had such a solid meet. Second place overall. Here's your dismount, back handspring, step out, one and a half twist off. Kind of typical of her entire meet. Uh, Shannon always under control, makes it look easier than it really is, and a 9.4 on the beam in her group. She begins in second place. Uh, that may be a, a big score for her. We'll have to see. And now Sharice Clark. Overall in second place in her age group. She just watched Petra Matthews open the door. On the bars. It's a chance to go right through or not. Big Shpashkova. Right back to an overshoot. A little short of those handstands, but big skills. Mm. Another release move. She is just about done. Double tuck wow. and nails it. Very nice. Great under pressure. Looking for her second title. Very mature meet for Sharice Clark, who uh, scores very well. 9.475 on the bars. Brianna Guy now. Her last event. Uh, trying to move up from fifth place. Front hand swing, front pike with a half twist. Big ball, plenty of power. Front hand swing gets a huge block off the horse, gets a half turn in, snaps down, and way over rotates. She gets to count one of these vaults. She needs to land this one. steps on the landing, but much better than her first ball. Really powerful, great height in the air. And one of the best scorers of the meet on the point point five seven five. Let's 
go back to the bars. Steen Jacobson is performing there in the 12 to 14 age group. And for Christine, the score is 9.3 on the bars. And now on the floor exercise, and in fourth place, beginning her last routine, is Amanda Carpenter. In this very competitive age division, that will hurt. That was tough. It's very difficult to see from the angle we were at what she did wrong, but it's a one and a half twist to a punch pull twist. Very easy to get off. wrong here round off by can spring full and a half twist she just seemed to punch a little bit early again it's tough from that angle but those rebounding moves the bounding passes they're so iffy on timing you just have to be perfect amanda hoping to score in the nines here on her last routine of the evening an 8.6 on the floor exercise Here's an athlete in first place, uh, Shannon, has been near flawless. And let's see if she can survive those slippery bars. All she needs to do is hit. She's got beautiful form, very nice toe point, gorgeous oh. finger, and another miss. Splat. But I tell you what, that's probably the prettiest finger I've seen in a long time. just been a very difficult bar day for these athletes. I wonder if someone's rubbed it down with some wax or something. Nice dismount. Andy just a little bit disappointed, of course. Disappointment with that skill. But once she starts hitting that skill, it's going to be a great bar team. Not bad considering 9.025 as she tries to hold on to her lead. And the 15, 16 year old age group. We are coming down to the final events from the Parkhead Invitation. We'll be back with more in the conclusion right here on CNA. 